let's look at two ways you can quickly and easily install multiple fonts, hundreds of fonts, thousands of fonts all at once. So I'm going to assume you've already downloaded a bunch of fonts, unzip them, and from there I would suggest you put everything in one folder. It will be much easier once you have everything unzipped and in one folder. That's what we have here, so let's go ahead and move on. The first way we can install multiple fonts all at once is we'll head over to Control Panel. I have it pinned here. If you don't have it pinned, type in Control Panel and go to it there. You could also just type in font and go right to the fonts in Control Panel. We'll go to the same exact place. Doesn't really matter what you do. We'll just head to Control Panel, head over here to fonts. Okay, if you're not seeing this, go to large icons and fonts. Now this is where all of your font files are stored for Windows. Now the usual way of installing fonts, I'm sure you know. In this folder we have almost 1500 fonts. So the normal way for installing font is double click it. You'll get a little preview, hit install. It will install that font for us. But we have 1500. <laughs> That's gonna take a long time. Much easier, much quicker ways here. So the first way we can just select everything. And an easier way to select everything would just be control A. Okay, but since we have two, uh, two ways to do this, I'm just gonna select some of these. First way is select what you want to install and drag them right into your font folder. So we'll grab these, we have 78, we'll just drop them right there. You can see they're installing for us. That's all there is to it. We're installing 78 fonts all at once. Okay, so that is option one. Those are done installing very quick, very easy, much faster than just double clicking each single font. Your next option, you don't even need this folder open, but we will leave it open just for funsies. Leave it open. The next option would be to do the same thing. Lasso select everything you want to install, but in this case, we want to install everything. So I'll just hit control A. That gives me 1,414 fonts. And what I'll do this time is right click any one of these and choose install, okay? Install, and guess what? That's going to install all of these for us all in one go, just by hitting that uh, one install button. Now, this I already have installed, so I can replace it or not. I'm gonna say no, or we'll probably have a few more of these that are already installed. So what I'll do is do this for all current items. I don't need to replace it, we'll just hit no. And now it's going to run through all 1,414 fonts, all in one go, just by hitting that one install button, much faster, much quicker than trying to do them one by one. Okay, and all of those are installed. Now we have 1,612 fonts in our font folder. Awesome, so that is two quick and easy ways for you to install multiple fonts, hundreds of fonts, thousands of fonts all at once, either by selecting what you want, simply dragging them in to your font folder, or by selecting what you want, right-clicking and choosing install. Now, once you have done that, what should you do with your folder? You can delete this folder now because all of the fonts are installed. However, I would suggest that you zip this folder up and then place it on a different hard drive just for a backup, just in case you happen to reinstall your operating system. That way you have all of your fonts downloaded and you don't have to re-download all of that. But that is how you quickly and easily install multiple fonts, hundreds of fonts, thousands of fonts all at once. And then all of those fonts will be available in all of your favorite programs.